हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू द क्रैक यू वीडियो सीरीज होप यू आर डूइंग वेल विथ योर प्रिपरेशंस टुडे वी आर हियर टू डिस्कस इकोनॉमिक एंड सोशल इश्यूज जीके क्वेश्चंस फॉर सीमेट एंड टेस्नेट 2022 प्लीज डू विजिट आवर वेबसाइट क्रैक यू डॉट इन एंड यू कैन डाउनलोड द प्रीवियस ईयर पेपर देयर इट वुड बी हेल्पफुल फॉर योर एग्जाम वी हैव लॉन्च्ड द सीमेट क्रैश कोर्स फ्रॉम 1st फेब the course includes detailed day wise schedule covering all the important topics and it's available for just rupees cmat crash course is for just rupees 199 you can enroll for five cmat mocks as well for rupees 299 link is given in description so please do visit and enroll for these packages for your better practice let's check the first question how much loan amount was sanctioned by the world bank to help india develop its first modern waterway the correct answer is 375 million let's check the second question what is showrooming the correct answer is b an individual visiting a brick and mortar store to have a look and feel of the product and then ordering the same product through some e retailers let's see the third question which of the following are millennium development goals the correct answer is e that is poverty eradication improving maternal health universal primary education and combating aids let's check the another question cpi and wpi as acronyms refer to the correct answer is c price indices cpi stands for consumer price index and w p i is for wholesale price index let's check the another question the demand for an inferior good decrease with dash in the consumer's income the correct answer is a increase so the demand for an inferior good decreases with increase in the consumer's income when people income increases they start looking for the superior goods and hence the demand for inferior goods will be decrease let's check the another question what is difference of revenue expenditure and revenue receipt called as the correct answer is c revenue deficit Let's check the another question. Which of the following will cause an increase in demand for a good? The correct answer is D. Increasing the price of its substitute good will increase the demand for a good, while a decrease in the price of the good cause an increase in quantity demanded, not an increase in demand. Let's check the another question. If India exports more than it imports, which of the following is likely to happen? The correct answer is A. INR is likely to appreciate against other currencies. Let's check the another question. Negative inflation is also called as the correct answer is B. Deflation. Let's check the another question. Many times we hear about SEZ in newspapers, magazines. What is the full form of SEZ? The correct answer is Special Economic Zone. Let's check the another question. Which one of the following is a point where the price, employment, and trade are at its highest and they cannot be decreased further? The correct answer is C. Boom. 
an economic boom is the expansion and peak phases of the business cycle so it is also known as upswing then upturn and a growth period let's check the another question who among the following are eligible to take loans under stand up india so the correct answer is d any person belonging to scheduled tribe scheduled caste above the age of 18 years so they are eligible to take the loan under stand up india let's check the another question which of the following is a bond in which the coupon interest rate payments are registered to inflation by associating the payment to inflation indicators like consumer price index or retail price index so the correct answer is d index linked bond let's check the next question in which account are the exports and imports in goods recorded the correct answer is a current account let's check the another question why are the indirect taxes termed as regressive taxing mechanism the correct answer is a indirect taxes are charged uniformly to all income groups let's check the another question which of these is the biggest tax reform made in india since independence the correct answer is goods and service tax let's check the next question which ngo publishes annual status of education report the correct answer is d pratham pratham is the ngo who always publish their annual status of education report let's check the next question when was the soviet union dissolved the correct answer is a december 1991 let's check the next question which is the world single largest manufacturing industry in terms of revenue and employment The correct answer is automobile. Let's check the next question. What is mean by trade balance? The correct answer is export and import of goods. Hope the video will help you in preparation. Please do like, share, subscribe and comment to our channel. Press the bell icon for instant notification. All the best. Thank you.